clam. Seriously, that girl cannot catch a break in this one episode. Oh, you did? Sorry, I haven't gotten any emails if you did it right here. Oh, wow, I see, I see you guys. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. I did. I need a dog. <gasps> Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa. Whoa, what the fuck? You idiot. Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the one that. telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? I just need a doctor. And then, and then I'll go. I don't want my arm to get infected. None of us want to get infected. That's the point. We got a doctor right here. Okay, he'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. Oh, boy. All right, maybe I'll be here. You know what? I'm just going to pause so that I can actually do what I, what I like to do. Uh, so, ADG-322, Kill Jolts, and Alien at uh, Sevastopol. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, all followed today. Thank you guys so much. Uh, um, I'm hoping one day that this whole stream will bring good things, but right now following is absolutely the best thing you guys could do. Again, thank you so much. Uh, I hope that I will keep seeing you guys pop in whenever I do various streams. Alright, uh, with that uh, out of the way, I don't want to keep you guys from the suspense even though it's <laughs> probably not going to be good for me. It's okay. Go ahead. He's a doctor. Okay, so long as he isn't like a Dr. Jekyll. Damn, that must have hurt. It still does. Thank you. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. That doesn't work. do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. You don't want to do something you're going to regret. Better to be sure, right? Come on. She weighs about as much as a sack of flour. We could take her if it comes to that. Who's she? Sarah, what I say, stay inside. I don't mean to be any trouble. Just want to stop the bleeding and then I'll go. You'll never see me again, I promise. And where exactly would you go? <sighs> to find my friend Krista. Forget it. You won't get five feet. Look, you mean I, I won't get five feet? Bite out of her, but still, she's just a kid. Worst case, she turns, and we can deal with it. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? Oh. We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. Okay, what if... what if I get a different what about fever? My arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... But then it'll get infected, like... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. 
Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. <sighs> it's just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shit. It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. I I felt like I needed to, Frost. There was no way I was going to let it be there. <sighs> Can I get, like, a, a light? A blanket, maybe? You know, at least make me feel comfortable. Or, you know, food will be great. Food will be awesome. Why are we doing this? Fucking hell. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, safer. <sighs> I can't believe this. At least she's applying pressure, I think. I'm not sure what any... I'm not grabbing a hammer. I do not want to cause them any trouble. How did they not search for my pocket knife, honestly? If you're that concerned, you would grab any tools I have and make sure I can't escape. Wouldn't you? Mm, tools have been ransacked, no surprise. Well, what do you want, Clem? <gasps> yeah, got it. Right now she's a little weak for anything. And tackle box gives us not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Wait, is she seriously going to do it herself? Uh, let's not mess with the board, because there's the... What good is the pegboard going to do? Honestly. Well, it's just something to look at. Fine, then. Nothing else in here, right? What a table. I'm impressed it can hold her weight. Uh, that did not help things. Alright, well, um... I guess we'll lift the shelf. At least get what we were after. Not that I really know what good the hammer will do. Alright, we have a rake, just in case anything gets dicey. Oh, I see why we need the hammer. Okay. Really, I would just go for the nails themselves. Don't worry about the whole board. Look, I really don't like this idea, um, but I guess staying in here might be a worse option. Are we seriously not waiting? <sighs> it's pretty safe in there. It'll be a good place to stitch up my arm. 
Wow, we have to sneak in and... I don't like this. I'm telling you right now, I don't like this. <laughs> Knocking. Yeah, let's knock. Um, screen door is going to make sound. Uh, with the lights on, someone's probably in there. And they should have everything boarded up. Actually, why don't they have everything boarded up? Aha, uh -huh. this might be a good spot. Hammer time? Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. I, 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 I recognize I don't have that much choice, but. I guess so long as I'm quiet and don't attract the walkers, it should end well, right? Let's see. House meeting in five minutes. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. A trap door? I've, I've never known a house to have a trap door, but okay. Um, let's try the knife. Ah, uh, damn it. Again, guys, thank you for joining me for the Season 2, Episode 1 blind playthrough. Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. She said she was with a friend. Yeah, right. Whoever she's with, they'll probably come looking for her. Great. They show up and we've got her locked in shit. You think we should bring her in here? No, I'm just saying it wouldn't look too good. Just at the truck in our Anyone else would be the same. You do anything probably with Matthew? You think he wouldn't? He's not exactly the type to let things lie. What happened? Happen. There's nothing we can do about it now. Let him come. I mean, don't give a What? I don't. How did we back away? What are we supposed to do? Huh? Leave her out there to die? Better her than us. You'd have done the same thing. It wasn't the same thing. Move. Come on. Let's at least get back in this room, and then they probably won't see me. Oh, I didn't think I was going to go all the way back out. Really? Um... I don't... Honestly, I already have a way in. Let's just, uh... Try to go back and... 
Maybe it's upstairs? Maybe we can appeal to that Sarah for help on where the medical supplies are? Alright, come on. Sounds like they're coming through the... Oh no, those are the steps. My bad. Let's see, what do we have? Bathroom. It could be peroxide, maybe. I think that's one of the things I'm supposed to find, isn't it? Needle will be useful. Are we just gonna take the needle? It's clean. I'll still need some bandages and something to keep it from getting infected. Um. What is it? Oh, they're moving. Let's hide in the closet. Damn it. Looks like they don't have anything in here, so I can't imagine they'll need to go in there. This is tense on a different level from the first season. Alright. I mean, nothing more I can do in the bathroom, so... I just gotta be careful and probably pick my doors right. Excuse me. I don't like that I don't have the option of listening. Let's see if she can help. Can you please help me? I'm not supposed to talk to you. My dad can't know. What are you reading? A book? What book? I like books. It's called The Gurkhoff. It's about transdimensional body snatchers. Cool. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurts. I could die if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I need something to clean it up, and something to wrap it with. A clean bandage. My dad says we're out of real bandages, but I know where to get something to clean it. That's what this supplies. Well, okay. where? Good. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Clementine. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super cool. Yes. <laughs> we are friends. Promise? It's important. Friends have to trust each other, no matter what. Do you promise or not? Okay, she's a little psycho, but I need her help right now, so... Me too. Friends. A pinky swears forever. I'll see 
if I can find the stuff my dad uses when I get a gun. Let me look around. I feel like this girl is extremely protected. You know, kind of like what would have happened if the stranger in the first season had a uh, battle work. You can't had a someone will find you. Don't worry. I will. Uh, sheltered Clementine from the apocalypse. All right. So, what about the bandage? Thanks, Sarah. That's all we need now. Oh, thank you for the reminder. Um. Well, I guess we go through here, right? <sighs> Alright, hiding spot in the corner. No, it's on moi. It has a drawer. Look at the board game. Wardrobe drawer. Wardrobe. Let's try the drawer. Sorry if it feels like I'm muttering myself. I'm just trying to think quickly. But again, thanks for joining me. Trying to play through Season 2, Episode 1. All that remains of The Walking Dead. And, oh, rags. Not exactly bandages. But they should help stop the bleeding. Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't know how in the hell I'm going to get back down there and not get noticed. Those, These steps are loud. Not to mention, I bet they're done with their meeting by now. Seriously, it's stuff like this that creeps me out more than uh, something like alien isolation. Come on, come on, get there, get there, get there. Okay, now all we gotta do is make it back to the shed and not attract attention of the walk. Oh, okay, it's just gonna get me there. Cool. This isn't gonna be easy to do it on herself, though. No, no, you're, you're fine, ADG. You are fine. Fine, I'm completely engrossed too. That's why I keep uh, relatively quiet when the dialogue goes. And this is not gonna be fun. This is gonna suck. Yeah, you're telling me. I remember sawing off uh, someone's arm. Okay, um, I think we start with peroxide. It's gonna burn like a mother. Just so everyone knows, I can't even watch the needle when I am getting a shot. So you can only imagine how I'm going to feel about this. No. Just like last time. Just how Crystal showed me. Last time? Do I want to know? Clem, stop breathing. You're <laughs> gonna make me freak out. Okay, you gotta keep going. Okay, whatever you do, don't black out. Please don't black out. Mm. 
No one told me I'd be playing Surgeon Simulator. And just a thought, maybe we should have grabbed a gag while we were in there. You know, to the voice actor's credit, this scene could not have been easy to record. Come on. Come on, Clem, just a little more. Well, it's not perfect, but it's better, isn't it? The rake, the rake, come on. Just once, I'd like something to go right. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Up. Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from us? This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not carrying a baby. I did. I took stuff. And I'm sorry. I really am. And you think you can trust her? God damn it, don't even start. Any of you would have done the same if you were half as tough as this little girl. So just save it. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. Damn right you will. Look, <laughs> sneaking around. We better get inside. You hungry? You don't even know. 